Hey guys, Assalamualaikum. Welcome back to today's video. Welcome back to my another lip products comparison. So I'm going to be comparing two different products that I love and they are from the same brand. Yes, I am feeling so excited about this. I really want to know how good they are, how good they will be after kiss proof test, after eating test or drinking test. These are the two lip products that are well known. I'm sure you guys have read the title of this video. So the product is Maybelline Superstay Vinyl Ink. This is the new release product now. And the other one is Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink. Both of these are my favorite. So if you want to know which one is better, which one is good, which one is more pigmented and so on, be sure you guys watch this video until the end of it if you want to know how the process would be, how everything going on, my reaction, and yeah, the final finish of these two lippies. Be sure you guys subscribe, like, and share this video. This is going to be fun and exciting. I'm gonna eat a lot in this video. Let's start off. Okay, I'm gonna start off with this Superstay Vinyl Ink. This is the shade Week 50. This is the bold shade from this collection. It's red, like really, really red. Okay, this is how it looks like. So, so pigmented. Actually, if you want to know more of this lip product, you can just watch my full thoughts about this at the end of this video. So, I will attach that video at the end of it. You can just click on it and watch right away. Okay, this is so bold. It's like Taylor Swift kind of lippy. I mean, she can pull off red lipstick so well. It's like she's so synonym with red lipstick. Another one is Superstay Matte Ink. Okay, this is the shade 270 Coco Conaza. This is the boldest shade for this collection as well. It's from Coffee Edition. I look weird right now and I am purposely choosing these two different bold shades so that I will see how much they transfer and how different it will look like before and after. Okay, I'm gonna leave it for two minutes, okay? On this side, it has matte finish but actually it feels very very comfortable throughout a few hours. I have experienced it. So if you want to know more about this collection, you can just click at the end of this video. This finish will be extra shine. All right, two minutes is over. So I'm gonna do kiss proof test first before I go for eating test or drinking test. Okay, I'm gonna do kiss proof test on my hand. Ready, one, two, three. <gasps> no transfer, no transfer, no transfer guys. Okay, one more time. actually a little bit of transfer at the edge of my lips okay so I think there's no problem with that I think I push it a little bit hard it feels nice it feels good so you can see the comparison between these two formula this one has more to matte finish and this one is more shiny right I have experienced these two formula and I can say that they have the same scent the same smell the same feeling but it's just that it has a little bit more shiny on this part okay in terms of comfortability they both are so comfortable but this one is a little bit more stickier than matte ink as I put my lips together you can see that this one has more shiny and stickier finish okay but I love them both so now let's start off with the eating test and drinking test I'm gonna eat something that is a little bit oily sounds like not healthy but never mind I am gonna be testing out this so you guys can see how good they are so here I have jumpa jumpa pisang tiba jumpa jumpa pisang And this one is roti gulung. Yes, it's a bit oily. Mm -hmm. There is no transfer here. More. Let's have a drink. That's amazing, but there is a little bit teeny tiny transfer from this vinyl ink. Very little transfer. It's like one dot of the color from this one. But this is so fabulous. It's like no transfer at all on anything. I can see that this is quite amazing. Okay, now I'm gonna eat ice cream. This is the one that I made by myself. Okay, believe it or not, I can do ice cream. We can learn everything actually. 
So this is ice cream Milo. Let's have a scoop. I can see that there's a little bit of inconsistency on this vinyl ink part but we will see the result at the end of it mm. <laughs> This finish still look good and untouchable. Enough with the ice cream, I'm gonna eat bread. So this one is not oily. Mmm. No transfer. Okay, tiny bit of transfer from vinyl ink. This one is like nothing. No transfer for this part. Oh, it feels so sticky. Still feels sticky. So after a while, it will be like this actually. This matte ink is so, so amazing. Seriously, it doesn't feel dry actually. So I am feeling good about this. The colors still look nice, it sits on my lips so well and yeah, it's very very comfortable. I'm gonna drink some more. As expected, there's a tiny bit of transfer from this part, okay? Surprisingly, the matte formula is more better than this vinyl ink. Alright, the final one, I'm gonna test out these two lip colors with another food. This is Maggi. Semua orang tahu kan Maggi? Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Mm -hmm. This is not something good that you can eat every day, okay? Mm -hmm. Panas! This is awesome. Like I don't see any transfer on the fork that I use. Oh yeah. Yeah, everything has a limit. So this is how much it transfer. You can see the vinyl ink transfer a lot. And finally, there is a transfer from matte ink because this one is super, super oily. It's curry. So this is what we can expect from. Okay, so these two products are like mix up together on this part because of this food. I guess this eating test, drinking test, kiss proof test of these two lip products are quite enough for you guys. I mean, I've been eating a lot in this video. So I am very satisfied with this wear test review. Okay, so from what I've observed, this matte ink is super, super stained and hard to remove with the food. So this one is like a little bit you know, easily removed actually. But if you want the finish that is a little bit shiny on your lips, you can choose this vinyl ink. Perhaps it's just a little bit of transfer if you eat something that is very simple and not very oily, something that is dry, you know. And you can see from the inner part of my lips is kind of removed. This is so normal. It's really, really up to you if you want to go for matte ink or vinyl ink. I would say that both have their own amazing criteria. In terms of long lasting, I can say that both are actually long lasting. It's just that this part is kind of disturbed with this matte ink, as you can see from my bottom lip. Right, so yeah, that's all. Thank you so much for watching this review until the end of it. I am truly appreciate that. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Tell me what kind of lip products that you want me to compare. Maybe local Malaysian brand, Indonesian brand, or drugstore brand. Everything that you have in mind, just comment down below. Alright, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.